Tonight, a community coming together to remember the life of Rhea Kadir. The young girl died from her injuries Monday after police say she and eight others were stabbed in a Boise apartment complex while celebrating her third birthday. Six on your side, Steve Dent joins us live from the Boise Center with the details. Well, hi. Hi, Karen. I'm live here at Rhea Kadir's memorial service. It's currently happening right behind me in the Boise Center. But earlier in the week, I had the opportunity to talk with Rhea Kadir's mother. Her name is Beef Two, and she described losing her daughter as devastating. She said that Rhea was her entire world, and she had to witness a brutal attack while everybody was trying to celebrate the three-year-old's birthday. But Beef Two also told me that she's scared. And how could you really blame her after seeing such a horrific incident? And that's why today is so important and a chance for Boise to show the community that the community stands with the refugees who fled their own home countries in an effort to get away from danger and come to the United States. But still, a week ago, they suffered such a violent attack. Fixed for the refugee community. I, I'm a child of refugees myself. Um, I understand what it's like to come to a country that is foreign to you, um, come to a country that's sometimes hostile, um, but then find those opportunities where there's love and there's community and there's people that will stand beside you and, and care for you and welcome you into their country. Now, Rhea favorite colors were pink and purple so many people here at the Moore memorial service showed up sporting the pink and purple and what i gathered from talking to her mother is that ria was just like any other three-year-old girl she loved to ride her bike she loved to go to the park she loved to swim and she loved her mother live at ria kadir's memorial service steve dent six on your side all right thank you steve for that live report and we'll have more from the service tonight at 10 o'clock